Hello everyone, last of the holiday passages, Tarquinius Superbus. From there, Lucius Tarquinius began Regnare to rule. Qui, to whom, on account of his deeds, the name Superbus, arrogant, datum est perfect passive, was given. Principes, the leaders of the senators who had cared for Servius, sorry, he interfecit, remember I've got a um, typical mistake there, he interfecit, he killed the principes, he murdered the chiefs of the, the leaders of the senators who had cared for Servius. Circum sipsit, he, circum sipsit for there, we would say he um, hedged around, he surrounded his um, his own body with armed men. Judicia, he exercebat, he was exercebat, he was carrying out um, capitalium um, decisions, uh, or laws of the state uh, without um, without advice per se solus um, through himself. So he was exercebat. He was exercising the laws of the capital without um, without consilis, without the advice, without advice per se solus through himself. Ita, in this way, he was able to kill, to send into exile, or to take the goods um, to to steal um, the goods of all all the goods which he was wanting. Etsy, even though the kings, um, the previous kings of the Senate were accustomed consulere to, sorry, even though previous kings were soliti erant, had been accustomed to consult the Senate about all affairs, Tarquinus carried out the domesticis, um, the domestic um, carried out the republic, or administered, managed the republic um, with its domesticis, with its, I suppose, um, consilis, um, with the domestic affairs from the house, from the court of the king, as it says there in the notes. Bellum, he um, alone, so he himself, he through himself alone, made war, peace, treaties, alliances. Latinorum, he won over the tribe of the Latins to himself, Maxime, um, Maxime, very much to himself. So he, especially, he in particular won over the tribe of the Latins to himself. He gave his daughter in marriage to Octavius Mamilius Tusculanus. He was the most noble of the Latins by far. Cum, when now or since, let's say causal clause, since there was now great authority of Tarquinius amongst the chiefs of the Latins, he convocavit, he called together a council on a certain day, con a frequentes convenient, gathering together, they met at first light. Tarquinius himself kept the appointment, but he came a little while before the ocasum, if you remember, before the setting of the sun, before sunset. Ternus Herdonius Aricinius ferociously had accused Tarquinius of being absent. Dixit, he said that Tarquinius was temptare, was, um, was, what we, was trying the patience of the Latins, and that he was affectare, and that he was um, striving for or aiming at power amongst them. The king, hoc cognito, having learnt this, because he was not able, um, on account of uh, his uh, pro-imperio, because he was not able, I'm trying to think if there's a good way of, um, of um, translating that pro-imperio, on account of his power, I suppose, to kill Turnus openly, he statuit, he immediately decided to accuse him of a false crime, to attack him with a false accusation. Proxima, therefore, the next night, um, by, the, uh, by the agency of Tarquinius, certain men of Arikia, the um, enemies, enemies to Turnus, brought into his lodging place a great number of swords. Tarquinius, um, a little while before light, Vokavit called to himself the chiefs of the Latins. He informed them about the hidden swords. I have learnt, look for an accused infinitive, that Turnus is seeking the single power of the Latins, is seeking um, the throne 
of the Latins himself or alone to hold, is seeking to hold the throne of the Latins, the power of the Latins himself, and that he is now preparing the murder omnium of everyone. Then he led them to the lodging place when the swords were prolati were brought out from all the hiding places of from all the places of the lodging um, of the lodging house. Manifesta visa s the truth seemed evident. Turnus was hurled into chains. Confessed him immediately. Con a council of the Latins was called. There, great anger arose. Positis having placed the swords, the weapons into the middle, and so Turnus, on a false charge, mersus est was. Um, or in dicta, not a false charge, I suppose we could say there. Um, and so Turnus, on a um, after the case had had happened, um, was the legal case um, having been declared. I was absolute there. Um, perfect passive participle after the case had been declared was drowned in the water of the Ferens of the Ferentina. The king, having increased his authority amongst the Latins, cum ace when he. Um, renewed a treaty which had been uh, antea, which had been made beforehand by Tullius. Um, so we'll say that, yeah, the, um, the king, having increased his authority amongst the Latins, um, renewed a treaty with them which beforehand had been made with, um, with Tullius, we will say. The Latins did not reject it, um, although the Roman state was superior in that treaty. For the death of Turnus was teaching them that the power of um, was teaching them the power of was teaching them the power of Tarquinius, and the danger of those who were resisting him. Tarquinius, although the uh, he was an unjust king in peacetime, however he showed himself not a bad leader of um, of war. Is primus he first waged war with the Volsci, and he took. Great power, great booty. In another war with the Gabi, a neighbouring city, he was not able to capture it by force. He um, attacked it with fraude, with trickery and cunning. With fraude, with... Um, what do we want to say for fraude? I suppose we could say um, with, with deceit and trickery through his son Sextus Tarquinius. For Sextus... The son of Tarquinius, um, who was the youngest of the three, crossed over to the Gabi. Um, Quirens, we'll say there, um, seeking or seeming, uh, yeah, seeking the cruel and, um, or angrily claiming the cruelty and in um, the cruelty of the intolerable, angrily claiming the intolerable cruelty of his father and promising that he was in direct statement, that he was helping the Gabi against him. Benigne, he, having been perfect passive participle, having been kindly received by the Gabi, he was allowed into their public um, decisions. And finally, he was made a leader. Proelia Padua. Um, small wars were made between the Roman, between Rome and the Gabi, in which the Gabi were superior. The Gabini... Um, believed that Sextus Tarquinius had been perfect passive participle in direct statement, sorry, perfect passive infinitive, had been sent as a leader to them by a gift of the gods. From there, Sextus sent one of his men to Rome, who sought the orders of his father to seek the orders in direct statement, sorry, in direct command there, purpose clause rather, to seek the orders of his father. The king replied nothing with his voice, but... Um, however, he was deliberant while deliberating the um, the matter. He transit. He crossed. He went across into the garden of the palace with the messenger of his son accompanying him. Abbot of Absolute. There, while walking silently, he deeket. He cut off the summa capita, the top heads of the um, of the. What do we want to say for the papadum? He cut off the top. Heads of the um, of the poppies, and we want him to say that, yeah, of the poppies. Um, the messenger, the Fessus, having been tired by asking and by awaiting to Gerons there, a response returned to Gabi and told the strange matter 
Um, Sextus understood what his father in direct question was wanting. Therefore, he killed the chiefs of the state, Varis, with um, various, um, in various ways, in, um, in various acts, in various um, crimina, with various crimes. The um, Gabi, the state of Gabi, having been destroyed in this way, um, was handed over without Kertamene, without a serious struggle by, um, by the planning and by the help, um, with his planning and with his help to the um, king, to the Roman king. Receptis Gabis. Having received Gabi, Tarquinus turned his attention to the Negoti, to um, Urbana Negotia, to the um, urban, to the affairs of the city. First, he constituted, he decided to dedicate, to build a temple on the Mount Tarpeus, on the Tarpeian mountain, and to dedicate the whole mountain to Jupiter. This, um, his father beforehand had made this vow. Sorry, had vowed this, had promised this temple, that's it. His father before um, before this had promised the temple. Ad hoc for this task, he used um, Etruscan craftsmen and um, operaris and operaris uh, and laborers and workers from the Roman people. The people also, having been led to other, um, having been traducta, we want to say having been handed over to um, to other tasks, made the um, foros, made the what do we want to say for there, um, made the seats in the Circus Maximus, and they egg it and built the uh, the cloaca, um, the sewer, and built the greatest sewer underground, which we see um, nunc even now. Multi many farmers were sent to Signia and Kirke, um, motion towards accusative, um, to be um, a defence of the city. So many farmers were sent to Signia and to um, Kirke to be um, uh, a defend to be defenders of the city. While gosh, this is a long one. While these things were happening, a terrible portent um, appeared: a snake. Elapsus, having slithered out from a stone column, brought terror and fugan, do we want to say brought terror and flight and, um, yeah, uh, brought terror and flight into the kingdom and filled the heart of the king himself with anxious cares. And so Tarquinius decided to send his sons, Titus and Arons, to Delphi, to the Clarissimum, superlative to the most famous oracle in the land. As a companion, we've got there, um, or the companion, a companion was added to them, Lucius Junius Brutus, from Tarquinia, the sister of the king, the son of Tarquinia, a son from Tarquinia, the sister of the king. Cognomen, his name had been uh, achieved in this manner. The king was um, accustomed to kill those chiefs of the state whom he was fearing. Amongst these, he killed the brother of Brutus. This man, i.e. Brutus, in order to avoid the cruelty of the king, consul, this man, in order to um, avoid the cruelty of the king with a re in a resolution passus um, immortatus having pretended stupidity passus est allowed his goods allowed the king to take his property and he recusaw it and he took on the and sorry and he did not refuse the name of brutus which as which means like stupid person or idiot he therefore then was led with the tar was led by the Tarquini to Delphi. Was taken by the Tarquini to Delphi. Um, various more as a joke than as a companion. However, he brought a gift to Apollo of a golden baculum. 
um, however he brought to Apollo, to Apollo a gift of a golden staff, golden staff in Clusum, shut up, enclosed in a bacul in a, sorry, of a golden staff enclosed in a corneo, in a wooden staff, as if, um, as a effigy, as um, a statue of his, um, as a symbol of his ingeni, of his character. I suppose we would say that. Um, after the young men came to Delphi, or afterwards the young men came to Delphi, and they confecherent, and they um, to what, completed the orders of their father. They decided to ask from the oracle to whom, to which of them, the kingdom was going to, in direct question, was going to come. Vox, a voice was returned, the utmost power of Rome, he will have the utmost power of Rome, who first of you, O young men, will kiss, will give a kiss to his mother. The Tarquini, Rotum Contemnus, rejecting, um, despising, scorning Brutus, themselves were permitent, I suppose we will say that, sending through, were checking by lot amongst themselves, were choosing by lot amongst themselves um, of the right of kissing their Osculandi, literally of a kiss of the mother being kissed at Rome. So they were choosing amongst themselves who had the right to kiss their mother. Um, Brutus, who had interpreted the oracle in another way, fell down and osculatus est and kissed the ground. Scyliket, um, obviously because that is the common mother of all mortals. From there, they returned to Rome. Very well done, everyone.